welcome back to my channel. So today I have my wantable unboxing and I'm just so happy to get it and open it finally. I got it while I was on vacation and I haven't had time to record and I'm just, I want to get my little hands on it. So let's just jump into it. So let's open this thing up and everything always pops up like this. Ugh. Well, it's my second box, but still, you know. <laughs> and it just has my name inside, and it has this thing, and it's like the same one from last time. Yeah. Tips for picture-perfect selfies. But I'm not sure if these are the same, but, like, the rest is kind of the same. Then it has my test in there and everything that I got in the box and what they're supposed to do. Then it comes with this fancy sponge. And inside, oh, looks like that. So I'm super excited. And I'm going to start with this because I just want to. This is a Vincent Longo Pearl X eyeshadow. Ombre, okay, I think that's another language. I'm not even going to try. And this is in... Etheria Pearl X eyeshadow. Hmm. I've never tried anything from Vincent Longo, and this is the first time. Okay, how do I open this? I'm already struggling. Oh, it's it's magnetic. Okay, <laughs> that looks interesting. It has like three different colors, but within the colors, like there's this green right here, and it has like blue specks in it, and I'll just show you guys up close because I don't think I can explain this really well. If you guys can see, this is a green and it has blues in it. This is a gold and it has kind of like the brown and copper colors in it. And this is the brown and it has copper and some gold specks in it. That looks really interesting to me. So I'm going to do a swatch of all the colors. The gold, it's kind of hard to get into just one color. Yeah, that is the hardest thing to do. This is the brown, and that is the gold, but it does have some of the brown in here and some of the green, because it's like really, really thin in the middle, so. And this is the green right here. It doesn't look that green to me, but I'm excited to try these out on my eyes, though. Next thing in the box is, I'm, I know this is a lipstick, I mean... It has to be. Okay. This is the Lip Teeny Straight Up Color Lipstick. And this is in the color Irish Cream Lipstick. Oh. I've never tried Lip Teeny Lipstick, so I don't know what to expect. Yeah, this is in the color Irish Cream. Oh, look at that. It's, it's actually a really pretty color. Let's see where I can swatch this. Oh yeah, look at that color right there. I like that color. And it's not matte, it does have a sheen to it, so I really, really like that. I like mattes, but I kind of have a thing for like the sheens, lipsticks, and stuff like that. So I'm excited to try this. I've never tried Lip Teeny, so that's another product brand that I haven't tried. Then there's this little tool, and I don't know if there's a name to this. This says a Mont Blue Luxury Glass Fashion with crystallized Swar Swarovski elements. And it's a nail file. And it has like little dime, like rhinestones on it. That is really, really cute. And that's so nice to just, oh, it feels fancy. I don't, I don't know what brand this is. I'll put this down in the bottom. And I don't know, like I've never had a little nail file like this, so I'm excited to try it actually. Or, you know, just have it. It looks so cute. I probably won't want to use it, but it feels fancy. I like that. <laughs> and the last product in the box, and I'll put this box over here, is an Ofra powder cake. And this is a mosaic, mosaic powder Roman 3D. I'm, I'm not sure if Roman 3D is the color of this. 
Yeah, Roman Roman 3D mosaic. Mosaic? I'm butchering names today. Okay. So you open it like this, and it looks just like that. And it does have a mirror, and you can put a compact there or something, or like a little brush or something. But that is how that looks. I don't know if this is supposed to be like a bronzer or just a powder. Maybe I should look this up. Yeah, it's a it's a bronzer. Uh, it doesn't look that like bronzer-ish kind of. Maybe it's, I don't know. It doesn't really look like a bronzer color to me. But we'll see how it works as a bronzer. And if I don't like it as a bronzer, I'll probably use it as, you know, like a blush or something. I'm not too sure how this will work. So I'm excited about this. Kind of scared. <laughs> but um, Ofra is a really good company. I've gotten a couple things from other boxes and things like that. So I know that Ofra is, has really good products. So that is it for my wantable unboxing i'm actually really excited to try the eyeshadow the lipstick looks really really pretty the nail file i probably i don't know i don't think i'll use this because it i don't really use nail files i don't know if that's good or bad or whatever um but i don't know it looks so fancy like i like it and the bronzer i'm i don't know i'm kind of excited to try it see how it looks on me and if you know how I'm going to use it I'm kind of you know still thinking about how I'm going to use it if it doesn't work as a bronzer I'll probably use it as a blush but I'm not too sure but that is it I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next video bye